Hello, hello! Welcome back to Pixel Heroes! Adventure 2! What are you? Psionic? What? As a child, she taught herself magic to fend off bullies. She's working on her great Pixtonian novel. Wow, double up on intelligence there. She has nightmares of dancing naked at a haunted tavern every night. Allegedly, she fought the famous Battle of the Ugly Temple. The Queen Forest is her favorite book. She famously defeated an obese cat in a duel. Okay. So you're all up in the faith, but you're also pretty intelligent. So that's confuse the first one and the second one, or confuse all of them. Wow. Luja, Luja. Well, we're gonna rename these heroes here. Wow, this this is weird. All right, backspace. Can I just type? I can just type. Okay. Off of some of my most active commenters. So first one being Siam, I am, like the most active. We're gonna have you. Uh, let's see what else we have. We have what are you? A shadow mancer. Inflicts curse and concealing. Interesting. What are you? Herbalist. So you have some healing. You can also stun. Okay. Pretty heavy in the faith. Also a little bit of nice life there, I guess. Not super great. Uh, what else? What else? What are you? Brewmaster. Huh. Okay. So for the entire party, that's pretty good. And Flick's drunk? I'm not sure. He's very beefy. And just generally buffs the party, I guess. Second highest commenter, Yami Bakura. Very, very heavy on the comments there. We need someone that can be up front and do stuff. We need someone that's high strength. Or high dex, either one. I guess Slicey is about as good as it gets. I mean... What are you? You're just a straight up adventurer. No one cares about you. Yeah? I guess we're gonna have Slicey the Dwarf Fighter. Huh. Alright. And then another person I reply to quite a bit, Angamoth. Okay, so we have super beefy general party buffer, Yami Bakura. Angamoth the strength machine, and then Siam I am, mage slash healer. This will be interesting. Does it have a little barreled? Protects until the next action of the hero. Huh. Well, we'll see. Trying for some fresh stuff, so. What are you? What are you? Greetings, young heroes! I am Counselor Fergus. I can almost taste your craving for adventure and mystery, but be prepared, for I have something of utmost importance to tell you. People have started to see a strange object coming from coming down from the sky. I decided to call it Mysterious Flying Object, or MFO. It might be something otherworldly and hostile. I am currently studying the strange MFO sightings all over this town. Once you've completed the requests of the villagers, I shall contact you again and hopefully provide more information on the MFO. Sounds interesting. Well, what about the casino? They're still out of business. Okay. So you're probably the only one, Serena. No, there's a... You as well. What do you have? Lily. 
the arcane armor. So we do visit the same locations. That's kind of frustrating. That's not very interesting. Hello, my name is Lily. My aunt does not want me to talk to people. She says they're dangerous, especially people from outside Pixton. She says they bring disease, we will all die. Like mom and daddy did. I wish my parents were here. Come on in. My mommy had an amulet. She always wore. Can you find that for me? Sure. We'll go to the arcane ar armory. I won't tell auntie. She will scold me for talking to you. Bye. So what do we have? We have gold. We have three items to start with. Okay. Intelligence plus four. What is that? It is nothing. Faith eight. Strength minus four. Faith plus eight. We'll bash you up front, and then Yami Bakura, and then the Psionic. I am, I am. Blue balls. Huh. Well, let's give you bonus faith here. What do you even work on? Okay, you're a faith healer. I guess. Your faith's pretty high. Sure, have some faith. And you don't need any intelligence whatsoever. <laughs> you really don't. But we'll make you immune to sickness. So I guess that'll work. Okay. So we need a hat, for sure. Let's look at the library first. Maybe she has something interesting she can sell us. We haven't really decided what we're doing yet, so... You're a faith healer, so I guess that works. And then you're like a straight-up magician person. Who just got faith buffed. Yeah. Yeah, but your faith is higher, that's right. Your faith is higher. Of course, your only stats are, like, faith and life. Well, right now you got blue balls. It does hit one of them for 43. Well, so far it's the best we have, I think. Of course, this actually might be better, straight up better. Yeah, we have some better options here. Light Magic of Blaze. Interesting. Hit the first two or hit all three? Let's go for all three here. So, let's buy this for you. And we'll sell your blue balls. So, fresh magic that inflicts bleed, which is not very powerful, but so be it. And then, the Mediocre Spear of Boredom. I don't see that being super useful here. But we can't replace it with anything right now. So, well, what about this? So, you have 34 healing. You, have the, you guys have the same faith buff. He just has more faith. 41. So, that's better. I guess you can have blue balls, then not super great for you, but what else are you going to get? Uh, at least for now. So you can be our healer. The Mediocre Prayer of Vita. Do we want to get another healer? Hang on, you have a better heal book, don't you? Yeah, you do. I'll just buy the better heal book. It works out well. Alright. Heal. Your skills are not healing. Yours are... There. You can have your book back. We'll have two guys that can heal a single. And then you do AoE magic with your high intelligence. And you only have faith and life. So chances are you're going to end up switching out to something. I don't know what, but something. Uh, I'll go for range. We'll grab the range. Okay. 164, 135. I just want to make sure the prices aren't different here. 
So let's go to the blacksmith. Okay, no, they're not different. Okay. So that's all sold and done for. We need a hat and maybe a better weapon. Maybe a better shield. What do you have? Two and one. Well, it's a little bit better. It's not that expensive. We're looking for a hat for the mage. Uh, do we want physical or magic? Let's go buy both. And we'll sell that. Okay. 39 physical. We need to be able to do straight up physical damage. That's interesting. But I'll pass. Huh. Dex based, magic based a little bit. No, we'll grab... Ah, oh, really? Hang on, maybe we can sell something else. No, it doesn't look like it. You need something for your head. And you need something for your head. Okay. There's not really anything else we can sell. We're at 93. Eh, we'll get a better shield. Alright. We'll get a better shield over time. It'll be fine. Alright, well, I guess we'll start. We have 93 funds left, so let's head to the Arcane Armory. See how this works. Whoops, wrong button. Here we go. We'll see how it works. What's our first one? Ah, the snail. Yes. The Boneyard. We've already we've been to all these though. We'll talk about Devil's Reef. Ah, the Devil's Reef, a dangerous place that is under control by an ancient and powerful crustacean. The giant crab, I believe it was. Or the great crab or something. You should prepare yourself for enemies that can poison you and make you soft. Beware the jelly cubes, they are extremely resilient and have different elements depending on their color. Weapons infused with the warm spirit could help you de defeat their dark forces within. Yes, they could. What else are we going to find? A puppy! Let's give the puppy food and water and hope we get a combat here. Puppy scarfs down the food with alarming speed and scampers off into the bushes. Okay. Oh, hey, who are you? Tall guy. Greetings, my friends. You look a bit tired and weary. Can I offer you something to drink? I have several tasty beverages can I offer you. Which one do you like the most? Well, I mean, let's lay into him. Your heroes draw their weapons and start attacking the guy for no apparent reason. He flees into the woods where you're soon surrounded by wild animals. Okay, let's try to practice some combat here. So you have mass confusion, single confusion, single heal, mass magic, single heal, physical, Party healing that also inflicts some buffs. And barreling, which is interesting. And then you have your shield bash bulwark, the axe of boredom, and the shield of boredom. Well, let's open up with magic here. AoE magic. Wow. Seriously? Holy cow. We just laid into him. Holy cow. That was really really powerful. Well done. The Fine Hood of Health. Okay. Nurturing Ring of the Saint. Snake Skin. And some potions. Life 4, Strength 4, Dex minus 4. Uh, yeah. We're at 39. 41. And we have more life. Intelligence plus four, I don't think we need. Faith is probably fine here. Eh, it could go either way. I need something that gives faith and intelligence would probably be the best. Alright. Well, let's do room one. We've been to the Arcane Armory before. Nothing we can't handle, right? Mechadron Mutilator, Insane Alchemist. What about Mass Confusion? Oh... Yeah. Beat up on yourself. No, don't beat up on me. 
Ah, it goes flap, flap. Flap, 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 flap. Why don't you do a nice 34 healer, a small heal. Hmm. Still some time for mass confusion, that's fine. Boom! Nice, ineffective, and regularly effective is the worm. Fair enough. Anti-rust? He's hard! No! I can't allow it! Smack him over the head! We don't have any direct, phys like, magical damage. We need some things direct magical damage. And I think that's possible. I think it is very possible to find it. Is that a confusion book? Oh, I hope that's a confusion book. That would be hilarious. Just confusion everywhere. Oh, party heal. Is that... That's just heals. Yeah, I know. I already changed your battle positions. Eh, it's okay. Strength plus four, faith plus eight. Well, that's just a straight up... More strength. Not that it matters. In fact, you'd probably be better off with the extra defense. But I like the extra health. It's an extra couple health. So, great. Yeah, no, that's good. That's good. All right. March on! That's interesting. Open up with some magic. Ineffective and absorbed. But the steam golem's nearly dead, so I guess that's good. Heal, Angamoth. There you go, buddy. Blade Storm. I'm not concerned. Let's smack him. Okay. Exterminate. Yeah, we're okay. Problem is, I don't have any, like, mega heals. So we're gonna have to really focus on taking these guys out quickly. Because uh, the only real party heals I have is this one right here, right now. And that's not great. Let's go and go party heals. Because why not? Makes us tough to kill. Ah, they're going to be tough to kill too. Well. Is that one and two? Or just one or two? Okay. 51's pretty good heal. I think we can wait. One damage. Oh man. Four damage. Oh buddy. Things are getting crazy in here. Hey, got rid of him. Great. Electrocute. Still doing okay. Let's go ahead and shield bash. Weaken your defenses a little bit. Alright. Heal up, Angamoth. There you go. You're still stunned. That's fine. Poke! Poke a doo doo! Poke a doodle doo! Alright, Angamoth, feel better. I really want someone in this party to have. An anti-debuff. Wow, that did basically nothing. Wake up, Angamoth. We need you. Hmm. Alright. We have, like, nothing to use against this guy. It's crazy. Here you go. Bam! Got him. Pathetic Hex of Thunderbolt. Oh, man. The Nurturing Ring of Water could be good. Pretty much any items are good right now. Like, almost any item is good. What do you got? Same thing. Life 4, Strength 4, Dex 4, Dex minus 4. Immunity to Poison or Resistance to Blue. I'll pass. Ah, here we go the same on both of you. Here's your new spear. It does magical damage. Straight up better. And it does magical. I was looking for a magic weapon. We found one. Good stuff. Ooh, what did we find? Mysterious coffin. Requires average intelligence. Well, Sam, I am. You're brilliant. So we'll use you. And if you fail this, it's XCOM all over again. You did it. Good job. Congrats. What do we get? Curing Bag of Freedom. We gotta level up soon. 
Mighty Hymn of Favor. Weak Stick of Complexity. Bracing Pouch of the Hunter. The Frigid Necklace of Help. Impotent Lyrics of Palladium. Hardening Talisman of Help. Shiny Scutum of Greed. And that's it! Level up! Hooray! Alright, Angamoth. How about you get some health? Yami Bakura. I still don't know what I'm doing with you. But I think Faith is probably the right choice here, considering that's all you're really good at. And Siam I am. That's tough. You're good at both. Let's raise both of your stats. What do we have? A shield. That's pretty good. Grab the shield. Immunity. Well, that's it. Strength 4, Dex 9. Whoa. It's pretty good for power here. 43, look at that. Single. Conceals the target. That's not enough healing for me to really care. Protects from magical damage and heals as well. You know, it's not terrible, but it's not great either. Like, that's the big thing. Like, it's not terrible. It's not, but it's not great. I am not interested. I'll take my extra magic defense and my shield. And my newfound dexterity. And move on. Room four. Ooh, what are you? Average intelligence. Well, so I am, I am. Would you like to give it a shot? Enigmatic Sphinx. Yay! 83% success. More loot! Pathetic Shaft of the Fumbler. Protecting Breastplate of the Leviathan. Old Curse of Icicle. Shiny Bonnet of Immunity. Pacifistic Necklace of Snakeskin. Hefty Askia of Piety. Vital Bag of Freedom. Shoddy Pole Arm of the Fumbler. Okay. Great stuff. We're way over here, so... Let's see. That's not useful for you guys. We got three physical here. Well, let's give you the extra chunk. And then you can have this new thing. There you go. It's a little bit better. Okay. Curse of the Icicle will pass. One. But immunity to infestation, which I don't care much about. Life plus four strength, minus four faith, plus four. Life and faith. Sounds familiar. We don't need it. 48. Wow. A little bit better. Also buffs on faith, which is interesting. Life four, dex four, faith four. Again, it, it's just not that helpful. All right, well, now it's time to start dumping stuff. So let's dump a lot. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Uh, one of you guys has like a, yeah, zero. Get rid of that. Mediocre shield of boredom is worthless. Mediocre axe of boredom. And we'll get rid of this useless mantle. Great. We're a little bit stronger now. Room five. Oh, here we go. That is good as dead. Boom! Effective! Well done. Oh no! Not the poison! Wounded, huh? Whoa! Siam I am! Don't die, sir. 
Don't die, sir. We're gonna have to get you some more health. Because you are not in a good place. Oh my goodness! Please leave Siam I am alone. Heal the whole party, Yami Bakura. Give us a little bit of resistance here. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad I put that on. Ah, heal. There you go. Oh my goodness. Leave Siam I am alone, sir! Please. Oh, man, it's brutal. I'm glad we have the extra defense and all that, but wow. I don't need this in my life. Get out of here, Steam Tank. The Mystic Book of Vita. Fly Jacket of the Leviathan. Pathetic Chant of Abatement. Quickening Fetish of Insight. And some potions. Wow, 52? Oh, it's just under. Party heals our heroes. Dang it! I was hopeful for a minute there. To no avail. What's that? Dex 5, Intelligence 5? Eh. So you're pretty worthless. Uh, you're pretty bad. Mediocre. You're mediocre. And that's pathetic, so we'll dump that. Okay. Yeah, on our next level, we should probably try and give you more life, although... We really can't. That's a problem. We really can't, because you don't have much for a life skill. What in the world? Flesh Golem. Right. You know what? We might end up barreling Siam I Am. It's very possible we could barrel Siam I Am. Ah, uh, the poison. Magic! Hey, good enough. Good enough. Cleave! Ouch. Uh, can we get a little bit of bolstering here? Alright. Feeling better. Just in time to take that aim shot to the face. Chop him down! Nice. Well done. Another aimed shot. How much do you heal? 45? It's not bad. Heal Angamoth for 45. Well, there's the burning. Face! Got him. GG. Elegant Enchantment of Pestilence. Fortified Curious of Tedium. Unreadable Hymn of Abatement. Oh, goodness. The Light Dress of Adequacy. And some potions. Level up! Yeah, giving you more life is just not gonna happen. Like, it just... It just not. Well, we'll stick on both. And you're just sticking with faith. I'm sure your faith will pass up soon. Can we get you a little bit more... A little bit more life, so you can resist a little bit longer. Nice. I will gladly take this. It does less damage, but it does just straight up infestation damage. Like, that's huge. That's amazing. It just heals everybody. That's not very good either. Okay. Get rid of this. And this. And this. Grand magic of metal spikes. Well, get rid of the Mediocre Spear of Boredom. Okay. Room 7. Hello. Schrodinger's Cat. Infestation, please. Nice. Oh, the damage potential 
Oh boy, the damage potential. I'm looking towards it. Mm. Infestation is really strong here. Really want to see the damage potential come through. So Yami Bakura can heal Sayamayam fairly comfortably. Whoa, that was good. One more? Will it be enough to outright kill him? No, but the infestation will. Mm. Which is good, because I don't want to deal with Schrodinger's cat. That's that's a just an evil thing to have to fight. Okay, they're gonna die soon. All we have to do is heal. And just be ready. Okay, at 48, try and heal yourself, Yami Bakura. Uh oh. Oh! Bye bye. There it is. Alright. Shameful Horizon of Vita. Unreadable Horizon of Shelter. Wow. Curing Pouch of Health. Ah, big potion. Good. Ah, big potion. At 42, I don't think it's worth it. We'll, we'll dump that. Yeah, and that's pretty bad too. Yeah, we'll just dump you. Alright. So let's make sure we are topped off all around. Everybody gets some potions, because there's tons of potions in the game. Here we go. Boss battle. All your base are belong to us. Booting mad scientist mode, initiating elimination. Proceed. Okay. Can you be infested? Immune to infestation. But not sickness, apparently. The aim shot I'm not worried about. We'll bolster up here soon. Uh, but first... Shield bash. Whoa! Bombardments! Bolster up our defenses, please. Yeah, it's gonna be tough to break through that, isn't it? Go face! That's not bad damage. Mm. So I am, I am, you're still good to go. Uh, I would like to see some confusion out of him. He's confused! Ah! <laughs> Worked against us! Self-repair. Oh, man, he's hard. Shield bash. Now he's soft. Mm. Alright, get yourself topped off, Sam I am. Top of time. So mash face for 26. Heat ray. Ah. Well, we can bolster ourselves again, so I guess that works. Cool. Yeah, keep doing heat ray. It's fine. Doesn't do a lot. The ones that does damage, it doesn't matter. So we're good. Stop the pain. Alright. Shield bash. Holy cow, we killed him! Holy cow! I was like, at the point of, let's just, you know, edit out a whole bunch of this. Which I probably end up will, doing. But I was, I was just like, this is so uninteresting. Let's just routine, 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 and just... Holy cow, all of a sudden we win! It's like, whoa, where'd that come from? I'll take it. Immunity to stun. I'll pass. All three of that's just not useful. It's not useful at all. Get rid of that. We'll get rid of that. And we'll get rid of that. Alright. Let's go back to town. Hello, Colt. Attack! There's only one cultist. Cool. There you go. He is infested. Ritual dagger. Nothing to worry about. Angamoth. At Hotep. Uh oh. Oh! That's that's very bad. Kill him! Kill him now! Woo, that would have been very bad if that had gone through. 
Rotten Jerkin of Tedium. Devotional Ring of the Warrior. There you go. He had something nice on him. Devotional Ring of the Warrior. Strength 8, Intelligence 4, Faith 4, Life minus 4. We don't need that. We really don't. We get rid of the Rotten Jerkin. We get rid of this too. Moving on. Oh, hi, Death! Greetings, mortals! You are waiting for another party. Walk away! <laughs> Walk away. I don't need to fight Death right now. Oh, hey, it's a little plague dude. Attack! These guys are pretty tough. But if we can't handle these guys, then we've got some serious issues laying ahead of us. Immune to infested and sick, and they're all dead in one swing. I'll take it. Nice triple kill there. Devotional Idol of Presumption. Light Hat of Sanity. And some potions. Alright. We're very close to the next level. Dex plus 8, Intelligence plus 4, huh? Well, we're running out of spells. Let's see. That's not very good. And that's not very good. Alright. And back to town we go. Alright, all's well. And that went, that went pretty well. Hello, is that the amulet? Thank you. I'll wear it from now on. She smiles brightly. Here, I got this for my auntie. She doesn't know I took it, but she won't miss it anyway. Thank you again. Hemostatic Pouch of Brutality. That sounds interesting. Can I go? You have no quest. Okay, I was just curious. What's this do? Woo wee! We're wearing it. We're wearing it. Holy cow. That strength, though. Zero faith, and this weapon actually has a faith scaling, but it's very minimal. Wow. Well, there's your strength. Horning or mustachio. The Biting Woods. Eh. Maybe later. There's the Biting Woods. And Horning with Stormy Peaks. Hey, fellas. How's it hanging? Hey, yo. Did we meet before? I'm sorry for asking my short-term memories and what it used to be. To make matters worse, I totally ran out of my special tobacco. Major catastrophe, I'm telling you. Luckily, there's a shipment of new stuff on its way. Actually, damn, now that I think about it, it should have been here days ago. Maybe someone stole it? Maybe some monsters? Those buggers must have wanted some of it. Hey, would you try and find a package for me? Sure. We'll go to Stormy Peaks. Thanks, dude, you rock. Most of the people here aren't too nice to me. You know, I got confused for a beggar yesterday. Sucks, man, but hey, good to know there's still some nice people out there. So yeah, I'll give you a reward when you come back for my package. Sounds great. Well... That'll have to do it for the episode, guys. So, as always, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time with some more Pixel Heroes Bite and Magic. DFTBA.